Screen Team Media. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's like, it's strange that even a fake wedding is like very, very moving. The flowers are fake, but it still has impact. It certainly happens very quickly. Um, everyone is in another relationship just a couple episodes ago, but, uh, you know, I think it's sort of like they woke up one day and knew it was the right time, and um, so I think people are just not surprised, more happy. I don't know how Sarah Braverman is possibly unsure about the world's most charming man. It has been the acting of a lifetime to have any problem at all with Jason Ritter. I mean, I don't know where this is headed, but he's just like the most adorable human person alive. So if Sarah messes that up, I think she should just kind of like jump off a cliff. It's really, how can we trust her in, in, anymore? I think it is uh, a part of where Sarah's in a sort of messed up place over relationships, but um, I don't know. I think they're all kind of, it's one of the nice things about that ceremony is you just put it behind you and show up for your family. Right. I think it looks amazing. Yeah. Um, I, my only job was rose petal duty, so I didn't have anything to do with the thousands of fairy lights that have miraculously appeared. Um, but no, it is. It's, it's sweet. And it makes sense for the family that they would have it at the house and, you know, just throw them a nice party.